Uncle, what are you wearing? Not Halloween. One mask. The governor said, gotta wear a mask when you go out. So go and find my favorite mask. Oh, Uncle, COVID mask gotta wear over your nose and mouth, not your eyes. Not this kind. That's all I get. My old Long Ranger mask. If I wear this mask, nobody can tell who I am. No can identify who the guy, no more COVID mask. They're going to ask, who was that mask man? And the people are going to say, that's the Long Ranger. Lone Ranger, Uncle. Lone Ranger was alone, not long, Uncle. How you know? Maybe he was long. <laughs> get it? Get it? <laughs> Besides, he not alone. He get Tonto. You know who is Tonto? Mm, Kibosabe. Yeah, the Indian sidekick. He the brains of the operation. Read the clues. The grass bent over in one direction. The ashes in the campfire still warm. The hoof prints in the dirt. All stuff the Long Ranger don't see. Like the horse doodle, he went step in. Not. They're not going to show that on TV. Maybe not. But I bet Long Ranger get got to clean his boots every night. Tonto, talk to the chief. Chief, like one samurai. No talk too much. Sit, smoke, grunt. He say, bad white man, kill warrior, take woman. Tonto trying to tell the chief that the masked man one good guy. Chief no believe. Tonto tell how the long ranger went save his life. Chief no believe. Tonto tell long ranger horse silver. Chief no believe. Long ranger give chief one silver bullet. Promise to catch the outlaws, bring back Wahini. Whoa. Long Ranger asked Tonto, Tonto, what you see in the hoof prints? Tonto answered in Tonto Pigeon. Why Tonto gotta do all the work around here? Chief say, fat guy on small horse went that away. Long Ranger say, let's go before they get too far. hi -o, Silver, away! Tonto say, Sorry, Chief, gotta go. White guy don't know which way. Long Ranger asked Tonto, Was it the West Side Boys? Tonto answered in riddle, Bad wind come from all direction. Somebody went far. I think from the West. Maybe they from Wainai. Eh, not that far. Pro City, maybe. How come Lone Ranger not scared Tonto and scalp him? Good question. Tonto call him Kimosabe, trusted friend, because Long Ranger went save him from the outlaws. They went take all the women and kill all the others. Long Ranger was chasing the outlaws but found Tonto, almost mocky, and save him. Tonto so grateful, he decided to help him find all the outlaws and bring them to justice. Oh, and avenge the killing of his friends. Ooh, he like revenge. Yeah, all the good guys on TV get one sidekick. Long Ranger get Tonto. You know that Tonto means stupid in Spanish? Not, he not stupid. Why they name him that? Maybe they never know. Ha, my eye. I bet they knew. You ever seen Blue Hawaii, Elvis movie, had one houseboy named Ping Pong? Not. You know what the actor's name was? What? Tiki Hanale. I kid you not, I saw in the credits, but his real name was Ralph. I guess if you're in the movies, your real name not good enough. Ha, <laughs> even the real names stay fake names. That's right, and on Hawaiian Eye had one not a local boy, Ponce Ponce, happy-go-lucky guy with the straw hat and play ukulele. On the show, his name was Kazuo Kim Kisaro. Funny kind of name, eh? How many Japanese, Korean, Filipinos you know? And you know what is Kisaro? I don't know. Stu in Spanish. Maybe because he stay all mixed up national nationality. So Ponce Ponce was fake name too? No, nope, was real. Ponciano Ponce. That's one real Filipino name. Nice that name. Real name or better than any of the fake ones. Yeah, no. I tell you, I don't know why they don't use real names, like Zulu on Hawaii Five-O. 
That's one real name. Nah, his real name was Gilbert. But everybody knows Zulu, the singer. He get one show in Waikiki. Anyway, if you need one big guy for protection on TV, they all got to be big Hawaiians. So big, the crooks come skate. So big, McGarrett scared of him too. He hide behind Kono and tell, go get him, Kono. That was Zulu. Kono Kalakawa. Sometimes I forget and I wonder, why are they calling Zulu Kono? Oh yeah, Zulu, that's Kono Kalakawa. And I wonder, how come they name him after one street? One king, uncle. I think they name him after the king. Oh, maybe he royalty. He only go on the streets named for royalty. Margaret say on the radio, Kono Kalakawa in pursuit on Kaumualii, going on Kapilani to Kalakawa, past Kaimana, turning on Kuhio Avenue, headed for Kalaneana Ole, or possibly Kamehameha Highway. Except Margaret no can pronounce all the names. Maybe he can just say King Street, haha. <laughs> He went star, boy. That's what you gotta do, boy, if you like be one star. Make like you already one star. He named himself after royalty. He went Lord, Jack Lord. Maybe he should be Lord Jack. That's his real name or one fake real name? What you think? No, even sound like one real name. You know what his, you, you know what his name? Not really, but I guess you're gonna tell me. John Joseph Patrick Ryan. You know can make this stuff up. The bugger had all first names. Even his last name was one first name, Ryan. Maybe his parents couldn't decide. Then Bombay, I guess he never like have all those names. He went just choose Lord, Jack Lord. If he was gonna be royalty, might as well be Jack Lord because Jack King or Jack Prince sound funny. What you think? His real name wasn't bad. I guess he had to have a name match his hair, high and falutin. McGarrett, you never see him sweat in his suit and tie. You never see his hair go flat in the heat and humidity. You never see the curl on his forehead move. The bugger must use plenty dippity do. You never see him stop, pull out one comb and put more hair gel. That's one star, boy, one star. You're too funny, uncle. By the time he take care of his hair and try say all those streets, he lose the suspect. You ever wonder why the dispatcher not tell McGarrett? You're going wrong way, stupid. Because every week he was, he will always gotta go by Waikiki, Diamond Head, Sandy Beach, Waimanalo, show the ocean, the waves, the girls, like that. Ah, he just taking the long way around, eh? <laughs> That's why he never catch any crooks by himself, got lost. But he always arrived just in time for, say, book him, Dano. How come only Dano can book him? I don't know. He not tell book him, Kono, or book him, Chin Ho. That's McGarrett's Chinese sidekick, Chin Ho Kelly. What the hell, last name Kelly? That's not one pocky name. No can be Li, Lao. Even Chan. Chan would be good, though. Chin Ho Chan. Sound like one restaurant. You know who is Chin Ho? The real Chin Ho? No. Rich businessman, poor local boy, work hard, build up, build up, until he owned Ilikai Hotel. You know where McGarrett's standing on the lanai at the beginning of the show? That's his hotel. Chin Ho's Hotel. The real Chin Ho could have bought Hawaii Five O and changed the name to Hawaii Chin Ho if he wanted to. <laughs> my father, or maybe my grandfather, told me that he used to be Ho Chin until he changed him to Chin Ho, put two ends in Chin. I think when you come rich, you can add one other end. Maybe you can do that, Bombay. Ah, add one Y to boy. B-O-Y-Y. -Y. Boy, when you get famous, no change your name eh, and no change them to Kelly. What's the matter with him? Well, take it easy, uncle. Anyway, on the show, the actor, Cam Fong, played Chin Ho. His real name is Cam Tong, Cam Tong Chan. 
Chinese always get two word name like Kam Tong, like my name, Bao Kong, like your name, Hong Yip. I don't know how come Hawaii Five will think people no can handle real Chinese names. They want to make them all the Pakis Mohale. And the bad guy is Wo Fat. That's one restaurant. Maybe a greasy restaurant, so maybe good to name the guy, the, the, the cook uh, greasy. That's funny. The restaurant never get mad. Ah, closed down already. Long time, but everybody remember Wo Fat. Still get the sign, I think, in Chinatown. Wo Fat means peace and prosperity. Hell, <laughs> every Chinese restaurant name means peace and prosperity. That means if you eat there, the, the owner going to get plenty peace and prosperity, but you still might be hungry and poor. Might as well call them. Not great, but we take your money. How do you know all this stuff, Uncle? My father used to point out all the local boys on TV. Any show with Hawaii boys or made in Hawaii, he watch. Most times he tell, too good the guy, can talk like one haole. He think if I can talk haole, I can be on TV. But most times, all the local boys on TV only can be one houseboy or act stupid and tell, yes, boss, to my Garrett, or talk funny kind pigeon, the kind that no sound right. The guys who make the show think they know, but they don't know. So now you know. Tonto means stupid. Ping pong means stupid. Kazuo Kim Kisaro means stupid. Kono Kalakawa, stupid. Jin Ho Kelly, stupid. Boy, your name, English name, Chinese name, family name is never stupid. You get it, boy? Yeah, I get it. So why you watch? I don't know. Sometimes I just like see how much stupid get on TV. I told you one time I saw McGarrett in Star Market. He leave Kahala. He go store over there. Funny though. He go market in his McGarrett costume, suit, tie, makeup, hair all pomade, even his hands all white, just like one ghost. But why, mother, my, 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 my mother used to say, white ghost, how lay? Ah, that's just makeup, uncle. Makeup, eh? Maybe like one time I went see my favorite bar girl daytime at the market. I thought, gee, she looked familiar. I wonder who that. What's her without makeup? It was kind of scary. Oh, I went fast kind, turn around and go down the next aisle. Haha, <laughs> fool you, eh? Was different kind mask. No can tell who that without the mask, the, the makeup mask. Okay, so I, if I move my mask down, that's okay. COVID mask can tell who I am. Yeah, but you look funny with the eye holes on your cheeks. Well, better just wear a big bandana, just like the bandits. Oh, then I'm going to look like one bank robber. The sign on the bank say, remove hat, dark glasses, and face covering. Now the thing say, please sanitize your hands upon entry. Mask required for all transactions and place pens in used box to be sanitized. Please speak loudly and clearly to the tellers. Do not attempt to speak through the small opening in the plastic shield for, um, for documents or currency. Uh, if you cannot be understood, you may need to return to the desk with the deposit slips and write your request with a sanitized pen. Remember to return the pen to the used box and not the sanitized box. Please sanitize your hands with the sanitizer provided. Please note that the sanitizer may smear your note and, this, and you may need to shout your request to the teller. Avoid using words like, this is a hold up. I have a gun in order not to mistake your written request with a hold up note. Approach the teller with your hands up and wave your note in your hand like you are surrendering. Hard for go bank, too much rules. Even bank robber give up. Nowadays, everybody got to make mess. The teller, the customer, the bank robber. No can tell who is taking your money. That's, 
That's why, boy, you got to be my tonto. Keep me safe from all the bandits out there. Mm, Kimosabe, please put on mask first.